She don't want me playing video games. I try to tell her that me playing video games is a way for me to escape from reality. You know, but with her coming here, blah, 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 yapping, 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 blah, this blah, and blah. that. Blah, blah, blah. Don't blah. be trying to act special in front of these people. All right. So why don't you want me to play video games? First of all, if I'm having a conversation with you, for one, then I should be having all attention. I shouldn't be having partial of your attention. You're playing video games. I'm trying to have a serious conversation with but you. I was playing first. But we already discussed about this before I walked in, and you wasn't playing a video game at first. So now that I want to talk, you want to go ahead and act like you can't hear me because you're so focused on this stupid-ass game. So, what you got to say now? But when it comes to you, you want me to have all ears for you. But then when it comes to me, you only want to give me half your attention. That's not fair. Like, what happens to the 50-50 in a relationship? That's like 80-20. You've never explained that that way before. I shouldn't have to explain it. It should be something that you should already know. I'm not a mind reader, though. That's the thing about it. And that's what most women don't understand. All right. Like they expect us to be mind readers, and then all of a sudden, then we become, you know, that nigga ain't shit. Yeah, this. But then again, when you was trying to have a conversation with me and I was in the kitchen trying to get something to eat or whatever the case was, you was upset because of the fact that I was going to try to cook something and I wasn't giving you my full attention. So now that I'm trying to tell you that I want to have a serious conversation and you're not paying attention to me, it's like switcheroo. I'm the bad one here. I'm not trying to uh, compromise. So you have to just throw the video game controller? No, you can just put it on pause for a minute until we're done talking about the situation we were involved in. But that shouldn't make you want to leave, though. Like, that's my thing about it. Every time like we get in a heated discussion like this, you always pack your bags up and you want to run away and you want to try to leave. No, I just need a, I need a, I need some space. With a duffel some, bag? I, I need some space. Yes, down the block at my mom's house. I need some space before I kill your ass. Yes. Would you rather me try to strangle you or would you rather me want my space and come back tomorrow? Because you're not listening to me now, so what I makes you think? To you. Oh, now you listen to me after I threw your controller out the window. All right, all right. All right. You're gonna have to buy yourself another controller, by the way. All right. Okay. I just want you to know that. Again, nowhere going back and forth fighting. Mm-hmm. And this is where you're gonna listen. Right? I'll listen to you, and you listen to me. All right. That's fine. You can do that. Now, what did you want to talk about? What I wanted to talk about was this. I don't appreciate that the little time that I have over here with you, that you're playing video games half the time that I'm here. I'm only here for only a couple of hours. Therefore, it should be me and you time. When I leave, you can go and play your video games. I'll t- I- I tell you what. From now on, and I'll make this a promise, every time when you come over here, mm-hmm. you'll not see me playing video games. Okay. I'll not That's even fine. pick up a controller unless we're about to watch a movie. That's fine. Not a video game movie, a movie. I know, a movie oh, movie. Okay. I don't know what to say. It's not funny. Me and Portia have been together for a couple of years now. And um, How many off years? and on, you know, it's been two years. Two years. You know, pretty much. Um, and we met at the beach. You know, she was just as beautiful as she is now. She's trying to get brownie points, but it's not working. And she has an attitude that, you know, it's time and time again turns me on. You off. guys never seen his attitude before? It's not about that. But through it all, I like the way that I can communicate with her even after her throwing a couple of things. It's alright though. That's how I am. You knew that this is how I was before you met me, so. And I wouldn't change it any other way. And. Scene. It's a scene.